Hey there, this is a quick demo of Mintable and kind of explaining what the whole idea behind the project is and uh, how you can use it and have some fun. So basically Mintable allows you to create these cards which are ERC721 tokens on the Ethereum blockchain. And it's pretty fun and easy to do. Normally you'd have to code all this uh, token logic yourself, make sure everything's secure. And that's complicated and hard to do if you don't know Solidity or if you don't know how the blockchain works. So that's what Mintable solves for you. So let's go ahead and create, uh, we'll do this Batty Cat token. It doesn't matter which one you click. So now we're going to create some uh, assets or 721s or cards, whatever you want to call them. Like here's a, a meme I made, right? Uh, now real quick, just to let you know, you got to be on the uh, Rink B test net right now. If you're not on Rinkby or if your account is logged out on MetaMask, you will have an error over here that means you need to get your MetaMask set up. So we're going to make a meme. Let's call this so you can see these are all my other testers I have done. Uh, we're going to call, oh, let's see, what's this picture we have? This one, okay, podcast. Okay, podcast memes, right? Or um, loner card. We're going to call it loner card, right? And lonely is the name. Here's the image URL. Oh, we got to get the image URL. Copy image address. Right. Uh, now, obviously, we would want this hosted somewhere secure. Uh, if this wasn't anything but a demo, uh, we're just going to call this card. Card, maybe card one. Um, and then we'll give it another string of special edition zero. Right. It's not special. Right. And another ID. And we'll leave this one blank because you don't want it. Right. Confirm everything. We got the loaner card, no typos. Uh, probably want to open this up, make sure that's correct. Yep, that's good. And let's go ahead and submit that. Now, MetaMask is going to pop up here and it's going to ask for us to confirm this transaction, right? So, this gas price is set for you. Um, just go ahead and leave that there. Uh, don't change that and go ahead and press submit. Once this is mined, this will display the information for you. It will get updated automatically when it's posted to the Ethereum network. Um, so if you leave this page, you will be able to come back uh, and look at it again, but it's going to prompt you to send the transaction again. So you just stay on this page, give it a few seconds. It, it is going to the live network and is creating a new contract that you are the owner of. And here that is. So here is your contract address and we can go to this and you can see we're on Rink B because this is Rink B, but we have the loaner card, right? We just made this loaner card. Uh, we got the one lonely total supply. Here's the contract address, right? And so with the contract address, we now can interact with that on my crypto or my ether wallet, or even on our own uh, Mintable website, you will be able to manage that. So if you want the ABI code, it's here and you can copy that to your clipboard. Uh, but so let's get out of here. Let's restart, right? Uh, and let's manage that token that we just created. So let's go over here and here is the token address. And let's just put that in right there. It's got to pull the information off of the blockchain. And here we go. We can go here uh, to Etherscan and look at it. We can look at the information stored on the IPFS or uh, image link. We have our metadata. We have little share buttons. We can share it, right? If I want to post this on Reddit, everything works. And so we can get this posted over on Reddit and I uh, made it mintable, collectible. We have our transfer abilities. If I want to transfer this token, give it to someone else and we can mint another uh, child token underneath this, right? So this is a loaner card in one sense. It's a card. Um, but in another sense, maybe this was an asset or a deed and you wanted to add a new owner, right? And so you can uh, do all that right here with this mint functionality. You can burn, uh, which doesn't work right now. It's disabled, but it is coming soon. And so a safe transfer. Um, now that's a good point. Let's talk about some things coming soon. We are going to add the ability for you to have a profile where you can browse and collect. Um, and what that means is you will be able to now add the cards from other games that you play. So let's say you are playing Crypto Pets or Crypto Cities or Crypto Kitties or even Crypto Titties and you want to add those cards onto this platform, you would go ahead and you know have a add button that would look very similar to this. 
you would type in the address of that token and we would add that to our browse platform where you're able to browse all the different recently made tokens. Just kind of like what we see here, except it's going to be, um, you know, uh, a lot nicer. And so that's Mintable. And you can get some help and support down here from this help button. And so I appreciate it. And this is all just a beta. You know, we are in the beta phase. So this will be changing as time goes on. Enjoy. I hope you get your collectible on.